Hey there, this is Strong Boy 13 here, and uh, well, what have we got in stores for the week ahead? Are we going to see any return of a heat wave? Are we going to have a bit of a washout for the week ahead? Uh, any storms? Well, no, no, and sort of no in all of these three answers. Um, there is going to be a, sorry, I couldn't find a good place to stand, I'll do it over here today. Um, I mean, it's going to be just a very average week I would say in terms of the weather um, but there will be some sunshine um, no hot weather to be here with us this week but some very pleasantly warm sunny spells at times some showers not a lot of rain although possibly first night we could see a bit of it even that timing bit uncertain uh, and generally um, well maybe the odd thundery shower at its worst but nothing too dramatic mostly quite a week we've got a very weak jet stream with us for the week ahead so let's take a look through day by day i'm going to speed through this because i've got an update to tell you guys even though it could be on a separate video but you know what i'll do normal one full video because that's that's me that's what i like to do so let's begin uh today's weather well we had a bit of sunshine all morning we had the odd shower just then but it's generally cloudy right now but it's actually all right uh, still fairly warm outside. Temperatures could still get up to 22 degrees Celsius, possibly. Uh, but uh, some cloud about. Um, but there will be some warm sunny spells. Breezy, but nothing too major. Uh, so as I said, temperatures 22 Celsius. So feeling quite nice indeed outside. So let's go through day by day. I'm not going to bother the overnight thing because I've got to go through the speeding by. So for tomorrow's weather for Monday, uh, will be a slightly fresher field tomorrow. We've got. Um, a slight northwesterly to westerly flow from the um, direction of the wind speeds, so it will bring in a bit of a cooler feel to the things. But not especially cold though, the sun's still very strong at this time of year, so there will be some warm sunshine tomorrow, but there is a chance of one or two showers about. Some temperatures, 19 or 20 degrees Celsius typically will be a high for Monday. On Tuesday, we've got a brief ridge of high pressure, well, it's not been too wet the last couple of weeks. We've been used to the more drier weather. But I think, yeah, it will be a fine day on Tuesday. Again, the odd shower possible. But there will be some sunshine and temperatures. Where it should be for the time of year. 20, maybe 21 degrees Celsius. Very nice indeed. Uh, a few more showers on Wednesday, I guess I would say. Uh, again, I can't rule out the old thundery one, possibly. But there will be some dry spells. There will be some sunshine about. And again, temperatures near average. 19 to 20 degrees Celsius on Wednesday. Now, Thursday, I think fewer showers again. I think... We've got a weather system which is going to try and push in through eastwards during the course of the day or into the evening time. As I said, timing's very uncertain. So first day we could see some rain spilling in eastwards during the day. It may stay west of us uh, and may even dodge us. It may move to a different direction. So there's a chance of rain, especially on Thursday evening. Temperatures before then, I'm thinking is probably cloudy with some sunny spells. The odd shower possible and temperatures low 20s on first day. The rain could go through by Thursday night and then uh, maybe it could be some welcome rain for some gardens who have had quite a bit of a dry spell for the last couple of weeks. That pushes through um, eastwards and hope possibly. And then by Friday, uh, back to square one really, a couple of showers possible but there will be some sunshine and temperatures again around average 20 to 21 degrees Celsius. So it's a pretty, well, not a massively dramatic week, mostly quiet. There is a bit of rain maybe by Thursday, but even that, that might not be happening. It could change. Um, but that's all I've got to mention. And just a quick 6 to 10 long range outlook as we approach into August. The weather, the changeable weather continues. There will be a bit of sunshine, a bit of showers and temperatures again, roughly where they should be for the time of the year. So it's definitely not feeling disappointing at all. So that's your weather for the week ahead. Now, I hope you got me clearly. I've got uh, an update to tell you. It could, uh, as I said, could be in a different video, but I thought I'd do is uh, link to the for the week ahead because I feel like it. Now, what's going to happen? You know, uh, I've stopped the random acting thing. I know the fear is no longer up, but I used to do that for the last two years. I've given up on that. Is that I'm going to be replacing it with weather vlogging from Monday to Wednesday, which is going to begin. Uh, I chose the date randomly. It, it's likely to be happening now on our dates. It's going to begin on the 22nd of August, which is a Monday. And I'm going to be doing this every Monday to Wednesday, uh, hopefully every week, possibly. Uh, I can't completely guarantee it'll be every week, but just depending how it goes, it's going to likely to continue that for the rest of the year. And I'll think about whether it may continue into 2017. Also, um, what else was I going to say? Uh, I'll, then later on in September, which I'm going to begin on the 22nd or 23rd, um, could be a Thursday, it could be a Friday, depending on what I've got plans. But I'm going to be doing, because uh, I haven't got any comments yet from 
the weather forecasting for you know from different places and cities or counties across the world please comments below guys what i which which city i should do for the weather forecast um even before september you can still do that now if you want and i'll be happy to do it throughout the course of august probably so please write down in the comments what you, which city you want me to do for the weather forecast but by September 22nd or 23rd, which is the first day of Friday, I will be officially doing it once a week. But, um, but even that, continue put in the comments of which city or county should I do for the weather for the week ahead. Um, that's something I've got to let you know. Uh, even that, again, that's going to continue on for the rest of the year and until 2017. It could continue still then into the new year. One thing that's not going to change is weather for the week ahead UK. That's going to be continuing on for the rest of the year and into 2017 as well, which is likely to be happening. So, yep, that's an update I've got to tell you guys. Uh, so, please don't hesitate to comment. Um, also, beginning of August, I'm going to be... Um, may answer some comments uh, out officially on the video. Uh, maybe go over things plans, maybe by beginning of August, which I may do a video on something like that. We'll see what happens. Uh, but that's all I've got to tell you guys. I hope you found it interesting. I hope you did. Uh, as usual, as I say, like, comment, subscribe. Um, these links are in the the, uh, the left of the video if you want to see the past, uh, well, yeah, past week of weather events from heat wave to a thunder shower. Um, and uh, of course, my last weather forecasting video got nearly 100 hits, so hey, um, that's pretty good. Uh, thanks for listening, guys, and uh, more videos to come soon. Subscribe.